Hello everybody and welcome back to another last episode. This is season one, episode four, walkabout. They're so gonna kill the dog. Oh shit, that doesn't sound good. Maybe zombies? Oh my god. They should have burned the bodies. Oh, that's an animal. Nobody heard it getting there? Oh, those are snakes. I'm Elise. No, that man is way too suspicious. So I've been thinking about theories. Maybe he's like, like a god, like Odin or something. And and this is all like I was just bored and wanted to, to do something with my life. Bury them. And like an experiment or something. Digging will be I don't know why Odin. That's the only one need to burn them. I can think about. Yes. They deserve better than that. Better than what? Whatever Seeing you want. Wild right? That's what's Burn them! Go to God for their wishes. I think it's religions. the right thing to do. We don't have time to sort out everybody's God. Really? Right? Last I heard, we were positively made. And no one's no coming. Need everyone to start gathering up wood. Those bodies are gonna rot and it's not gonna be fun. Oh, damn it. The episode is lagging too much. And exactly how are we gonna find the sustenance? You could fish. We hunt. Yeah, that man is way too suspicious. Back. <laughs> got a better idea. Right? That's actually a good idea. Like, what else are you gonna do? Wait for a pizza? No, you need to hunt. Oh, it wasn't secured. Huh? Damn. Tell me something. How come any time there's a say you have a problem staying in one place for very long, Kate? Well. <laughs> so you want to tell me why you're really going? What else is she going to do? Just sit around and wait for other people to do so shit for her? So no. You saw her boobs. Can you find someone else who speaks English? On, there are other people there, and I'm sure. They all speak English. He picked the Koreans. Doctor, don't think I can catch a fish. Bitch, I don't think you can wipe your own ass. Oh shit! Hi, Hi. me? No, I, she I saw was, you. Uh, throw it in. And... Fish. Good. Sure, buddy. Why me? I'm. Why? Right? Why are they always bothering him? They're always asking him to do shit. Hey, quick, give us the steal signal. Oh, boy. Oh, no. Don't kill the dad. He doesn't have anybody left. Imagining you're some, uh, okay, I think this dude's mom never beat the crap out of him to respect other people. Especially what? older Norman, people. What? He needs a good snack. John, Last night I fell asleep in a couch at a friend's house and this John, happened. Okay? It's killing me. So witchy. I really hope I didn't catch Dengue or Zika or Chikungunya because ain't nobody got money for that. No, you can't. Just because you played some... what I can't do. Game doesn't mean that you know what you're doing. Ow! <laughs> oh, dude, you gotta... oh. Wife, girlfriend, a oh, poor woman. You know, the company until my husband got back from the restroom. He never got back. <sighs> yep, he's Family a keeper. Business. Maybe he's just trying to prove to his co-worker so and himself that he can Getting to do it. Tell Randy he's off gonna get himself us. killed if he's not Odin. Eight months. I'm not allowed to meet customers. A customer is uh. Oh, he's sick. Is that is that what I am to you? He's a sick motherfucker. 
Helen, 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 Helen. He's a poor sick bastard. I'm sorry, Locke. Oh, she's good. Poor Locke. He's just a poor sick old man. He needs help. Kill him. He may be sick, but I still don't want him to die. Do you still think you're gonna be able to kill it with a knife? Hello. Hi. Knife? Bro. Oh. They're gonna eat the dog. I cornered it. Oh, what's the matter? Can't stand to see me bending for myself. I'm so sorry about this. What? what? It's okay. Are we you just apologizing for you? You're you not doing it. Oh, you what? manipulated what? someone to do it for you. What an ass this girl is. Can we all agree in killing her first to eat her? After the sun goes down. Not much meat there, but. <laughs> My husband is not dead. What do you mean it's not dead? What? I knew it. This is a game. This is something planned. This is like a surprise hunger game. How do you know he's gone? We didn't see him die. What's going on? Probably not dead. All this island is a joke! He's alive. Fuck. He made it. I thought that shit was bigger than him. Now you know what? He works Jason, there. Texas. It was bigger than him. <laughs> Speaking about being disrespectful as fuck. So he proved to himself that he can do it. Whatever. She said it was headed right towards you. Did you see anything? Get any kind of look at it? He did. Say it. <gasps> see? He works for the people of the island. Well, unfortunately, What's his it is condition? an issue for insurance company. Can't keep the oh, you're dealing with! Don't ever tell me what I can't do, ever! This is destiny. This is destiny. This is, this is my destiny. This is, I'm supposed to do this, damn it! Don't tell me what, what? I can't do! Don't tell me what I can't He can walk now. What? How? He remembers how to walk? It's been four years. Don't you need like therapy and all that shit? If I like him or not, he's too suspicious. But I feel so sorry for him. Don't let it burn, you may need it. Alright, he is hella suspicious. He is hella suspicious, but at the same time, I kind of wanna like him. He's just like an old nerd, misunderstood person thingy. I feel sorry for him. His co worker used to bully him and. He was in love with someone that he talked over the, over the phone? What was that, like a suicidal hotline or something? That you call whenever you're feeling stressed to vent or something? I know those things exist in first world countries, but they exist. And he couldn't walk. How is it, or why is he walking now? I'm sure that island is not even in the real world, but it's in like some weird lab. Here's another theory. They crashed, yes, but then they took them all, made them all really, really tiny and put them into the island that they have in a lab. And they're just looking at them from above like, like you do with ant farms. They're just looking at whatever they're doing and how they're dealing with everything. Could be, right? <laughs> I think I'm going crazy. But that island is not natural, it's not a part of the world. I am sure there are a bunch of 
scientists experimenting with animals and shit and they put him there and this is just another experiment well let's see how humans react or interact if if their plane crashes there and they don't have any food or nothing to do and let's see what happens with our cute little baby animals if they eat them if they know how to deal with them if they kill them i think that's what's happening Anyways, thank you so much for watching this episode with me. Please go ahead and subscribe if you haven't and you can also follow me on my social media like Twitter, Instagram or Facebook. The links will be in the description box. As always, I'm Sara Miano and I'll see you in my next video. I am Peter Pan, I'll never be a man if you never wanna grow. Take my hand, I'll take you to Neverland.